Hey, what's up guys? It's Noble Flame here and I'm coming at you with a very random and very special to me video. I'm going to teach you how to make a monster grilled cheese sandwich. Now, what you're going to do, turn your stove top to at least, on a scale of 1 to 10, 2.5. That's about low medium power. Put your pan on there. And uh, what you're going to want to do is after maybe five, ten, five minutes or so, you're going to test the uh, test if it's hot by doing this. Wet your hands with some waters, your fingers, and then go shazzing. You should hear some uh, crinkle, crinkle, whatever. That means it is ready. What you're going to do, take your butter knife. You're going to get some butter, not a lot, just a little. Maybe about that much on the uh, knife. You're gonna take the handle, slab it on there, and you're gonna just let it ring about. You're buttering your pan so nothing will stick to it. Back on the heat. Okay. Now I've done this in pre-advance. You are going to butter both your t uh, bread. Give it a good coat. Then you're gonna cut, put butter side down. Now, on my supplies over here, I have four slices of cheese, ham, shredded cheese. And a spatula. Make sure this doesn't stick. Be careful. Make sure it doesn't stick either. What you're gonna do? Open your one of your cheese slices. Take it up and lay it on there. Good. Take a slice of ham. Lay it on there. Good. Let that warm a little. Check the bottom of the bread. See how it's looking here. Good. Don't want to burn it. Turn that down a little. Actually, lower your heat to two. That must work better. Gonna let your ham get toasty. When it does, while it does actually, get some shredded cheese. Sprinkle it all around the ham. Good. Let that warm up. See how it's looking on the other side. Good. Take that off. I'll show you what it looks like in a minute. Next bread. Another slice of cheese. Later. Another ham. Later. Good. More shredded cheese. Later. Let it rest. Grab this one. Okay, this is what your bread should look like on the other side. Hopefully I can do this. Nice golden brown. Make sure that stick. Looking good. Starting to melt nice. 
Check my phone. No one text. Sorry. Check it. Good. Is it still warm? Okay. Now, what you're gonna do is lay another slice of cheese. On there. Another ham. More shred. Now, on your corresponding other slice. for another second here. If it's not too burnt, put it back on. If it's a little looking burnt, don't do it. Last cheese. Last ham. Mo shred. Okay. Add a little more over here. I love my cheese. Good. A little more on this one. Never have too much. Oh. Good. Okay. Put that there. Put that there. Add it so carefully while dumping the cheese on. Ha. Mash it together. Yep. Now, real quick, turn on the heat. Moving you guys over here. Good. Alright. Take your grilled cheese. Put it in the microwave for, say, 15 seconds. It's one five, 15 seconds. Also remember to remove your pan from the stovetop. See how that's looking. Ten more, so twenty five seconds. Good. Ah, yeah. Wait, is it good or a little more? And make it thirty thirty seconds. A more. So this gets the rest of the cheese all melted and nice. Whatever the oven can do, the microwave can and will. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Now to cut. I'm going to do sideways for right now. You guys are going to see this. Okay. It's a little hot, so be careful. Messy, really gooey. Stay on. Okay. Ooh yeah. Woo! It is hot. Too hot. <laughs> Came and grab it. Move that 
that gooiness though is just amazing. Alright. One sec, let me get my hand back on there. Start moving around here. Okay. And she's back on. Oh yeah. Alright. Now behold. Ham and cheese goodness, look at that. Look at that. That is just a monster ham and cheese sandwich right there. So much cheese, so much ham. Relish in it! That's a little too hot. Wait, is it? I'm gonna be stupid enough to try it. Here we go. Let's try it. Um, mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm. That is ham and cheese. Well, my friends said it would go better with bacon, but uh, you know, when you don't have any, that's a little problem. But uh, you know, it's still amazing. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed cooking with Noba, the amazing and I would say myself perfect grilled and cheese sandwich. So if you guys uh, like that, hit that like button and subscribe for more. A random cooking video, but. I made this last time and I was like, hey, people actually like this because I posted it on uh, my Facebook and they were commenting uh, how good it looked, except for, you know, vegetarians, but because it's ham, but no one can hate ham. So, yeah, guys, if you like that and want more of these or might want suggestions, just post it in the comments or whatever. And remember to hit the like button again, hit it real hard. I'm Nova Flame and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.